August 15th, we Christians celebrate the Feast of the Assumption of Our Mother. And as Indians, we celebrate the 64th anniversary of our Indian independence. Today, the liturgy offers us the reading of Jesus' presence at the wedding in Cana. And he transforms water into wine by performing a miracle under the instruction of his mother. I consider that every miracle offers us a chance to give to the world more than what we have received. Jesus, in and through all his miracles, including the miracle at Cana, had given to his people whatever he could, but much more than what he already had at his disposal. A miracle is an invitation for us to share with the others much more than what we already have. But as we see it in Jesus, he always maintained a contact with the power up above, up above and he could therefore come out with much more than what was at his disposal. And as we celebrate Indian independence, we find that many of us complain that things are not well with us, not well with our country. In fact, it is at the backdrop of rampant corruption and many other malpractices that we celebrate the 64th Indian Independence Day. In fact, it's an invitation for us to reflect back upon what we are as a nation. In fact, I consider that many of the problems that we Indians face come out of the main problem that most of us are claiming to have almost everything from the nation, but we are not ready to part with what we have for the nation. The, the message that we have from Jesus to share with the world whatever we have and more than what we have should be applied also in the case of our Indian independence. In order to make our nation a prosperous one, I think each one of us has a responsibility to share with the rest of India whatever we have and more than what we have. It is an invitation to, to perform a miracle, a miracle by sharing what we have and to share to the outside world more than what we have. As we celebrate the Feast of Assumption, let's once again listen to Mother Mary, who invites us to help the others, to share with the others more than what is already at our disposal. Following the footsteps of Jesus, our Guru, and following the instruction of Mother Mary, our Mother, let's try to share whatever we have and also to offer much more than what is at our disposal. Then our Indian independence as true Christians will become a reality for us where we will be making our contributions as best as we can to the making of Indian democracy. I wish you the feast of Assumption and I wish you a wonderful Independence Day.